Hi, I'm Kyle Wiggers for Digital Trends, and we're taking a look at the Android M Developer Preview. Um, it's running on the Nexus 6 here, but it's available for the Nexus 5, 6, 9, and Nexus Player. Um, now, the biggest change you'll probably notice in Android M is the app drawer. It scrolls vertically, and apps are arranged alphabetically now, um, whereas in previous versions of Android, it scrolled horizontally, and, and there was no um, order to speak of. Um, and there's also a big search bar at the top now uh, that you can use to quickly sort through those apps. Um, there are also uh, improved volume controls. Um, so there's a big bar at the top for system-wide volume, but there are also uh, volume level controls for alarms and notifications there. Um, and the other big feature that Android M uh, brings to the table is uh, permission management. Um, you can now, um, on a per app basis, uh, allow or deny um, different services and software uh, per permission to access uh, things like your contacts or location. Um, and it works uh, retroactively, so if you decide you want to deny an application permission to something uh, after you install it, you can do that. Uh, you can re-enable permissions. And uh, it, it's backwards compatible too, so apps don't necessarily have to be built for Android M to uh, have these granular controls. Now a couple of things uh, Android M lacks right now that were shown at the Google I.O. keynote are uh, now on tap. Now on Tap is an extension of uh, Google Now, Google's Intelligent Assistant that's um, intended to kind of show you contextual information. Depending on what's on the screen, you might see um, apps that uh, will assist you with a given task. For example, if someone mes uh, mentions a movie in, in a chat conversation, you might see IMDB or uh, Flickster. Um, that's not coming until Android M is officially released uh, in the coming months. Um, also absent is Android Pay. Uh, we don't know when that's going to make its debut, but right now uh, it's much like the old system. Uh, Google Wallet uh, hasn't changed substantially. It still performs much the, the same way it did in uh, older versions of Android. Um, Google plans to release monthly updates over the error, um, so hopefully uh, Google Now on Tap and uh, Android Pay will make their way into one of those. But for now, um, Android M isn't all that different from what's out there. Still, um, there are little improvements like uh, faster performance um, and better animations. But you're not missing a whole lot if you can't install it now. It's available for uh, the Nexus 6, Nexus 5, Nexus 9, and Nexus Player.